Good morning, Mapleton Online students and families. Today's date is Tuesday, September 15th, 2020. The weather for today will be mainly sunny with highs in the upper 80s and lows in the upper 50s. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For our announcements today, we want to share that schedules have changed for K through eight starting this week and nine through 12 next week. You should have received information about this on Friday and over the weekend. Your teachers have this information as well if you need. School starts at nine o'clock and ends at two o'clock. Also, special schedules have switched as well. Even grade numbers, so kinder, second, fourth, sixth, and eighth grade have art this week. And odd grade numbers, first, third, fifth, and seventh have PE this week. High school stays the same as usual for specials. Remember, if you have glitches with your technology, you may call the help desk number. However, it is preferred if you email the help desk number rather than call. The help desk email is helpdesk at mapleton.us. For our teacher feature for the day, we have Janice Garpella Straub. She is our K through five Mapleton online instructional guide. We are so glad you could join us this morning. Can you please tell us a little bit about yourself? Hi, everybody. Um, so I've been a teacher for 11 years and at home I have four dogs. They're mostly poodles and I also have seven kids. <laughs> You're very busy, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> what are the ages of your kids? They are um, 16, 15, 8, 7, 6, 3, and then I have one that's actually going to be four this week. Oh, well, happy birthday to your four-year-old. Thank you. That is so exciting. We are so excited to have you here at, at Mapleton Online with us. I'm so excited. now we have our would you rather question. So okay. would you rather live without internet or live without air conditioning and heating? And you have to tell us why. Can I move? Because of <laughs> If I can move, I've lived in Hawaii without air conditioning and heating, and it's not so bad. Um, but I think that if I had to live in Colorado and I couldn't move, I think I'd have to go with no internet because I'm pretty sure, oh my gosh, it would be pretty awful if you didn't have heat in the winter. And it can be pretty awful to not have air conditioning in the summer too. They're both uncomfortable. <laughs> That's a, it's a hard one. I personally feel like internet is the number one thing that I need right now, but I might regret that if I, if I were to choose that. So, yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you so much, Ms. Garpella Straub, and we will see you soon. Hey, bye everybody.